What's up? This is John from John Brad's World Photography, and today we're getting another super awesome update to Lightroom Mobile that is better export options. So if you've been using Lightroom Mobile like I have, you'll know that the export options really aren't that great. You pretty much could do a small version, a large version, or raw, and that was about it. But Adobe just recently dropped an update that changes all of that, and you nearly have everything that Lightroom Classic has now. Let's go ahead and jump in and check out what Lightroom Mobile can do. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump into Lightroom on my iPad. And I have a bunch of different weddings and engagement sessions already loaded in. Let's go ahead and find something to export. Once I pick the photo that I want to export, I can hit the share option on the top right corner. You'll notice beside every different share option, there's these little gears. That's how you're going to edit how you want to export. So let's go ahead and choose export to files. But instead of clicking export to files, I'm going to click the gears beside it. This way I can change my different options. I have file type, dimensions, which you can set to custom as well. Image quality. And under more options, I can change the file name and add output sharpening. I can also change the color space. Let's go ahead and try and export a group of photos and see how that looks. So I'm gonna go back and now select a group of photos. Hit the three dots in the top right corner and choose select. Now I'll select my photos. After that, on the bottom right corner, I hit share. Same as before, I can set my settings. And once I'm happy with those settings, I can go ahead and choose export to files or wherever else I want it to go. Then I can choose the folder that I want the files to go into. And there we go, I've exported my files. Let's go ahead and take a quick look at them. Awesome, they look great. You can also see all the file information here on the right side within Apple Files. So that was a quick look at exporting files on Lightroom Mobile. This update is huge and it actually enables me to export my files on my iPad if I want to do something quick and deliver it. While I'm not getting all the options that I would have in Lightroom Classic, this makes a huge difference and anyone who's looking to actually export their files and deliver them can do this now on their iPad Pro. If you all have any questions about this export process, make sure to leave them in the comments below. And if you like this content, hit that thumb so I'll keep making more. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more information on the iPad Pro, mobile apps, and photography in general. I'll catch you all next time. All right, peace.